when you look at some of the you know people who are uh, senior leaders and and who are veterans, how are they best supporting young? What practices do you see them doing that are supporting your work and young professionals in general? I would say, and this is just a, a kudos to the Educaus community because I found so many of my people here. Um, but there, I don't know if I want to name names, but there's some senior folks in the Educaus community, folks who have titles of CIO or president or, you know, something in that level, who have reached out to me, even in this past year, and have seen my potential and have given me opportunities and have specifically and directly shoulder tapped me to take over something for them or to participate in something for them. Um, recently, this manifested with a webinar I just moderated yesterday, actually, it was called New to Higher Ed Getting Acclimated. And because of this person shoulder tapping me, I then shoulder tapped folks on the YPAC, three folks actually who currently serve on the YPAC to also come along and serve and deliver this webinar. And it's just such an amazing kind of display of how we can support each other and give people opportunities. And it went so well. We we had so much knowledge to share. And even while we were doing our webinar, I realized, wow, I'm with a group of young professionals who know so much. We have so much experience to share, so much perspective to share that I really feel is necessary to hear and to learn from. And it was just a great example of how one person in a senior position who could have taken that role and could have done this work again, but decided to pass the torch and give others opportunities. I would say um, support and flexibility. I feel like um, especially young, young professionals, we are so diverse and um, especially coming from pandemics, right? Things were so hectic in so many different stories in, in human beings in different places, in different positions. So I would say providing that kind of support and I, I'm asked what I say, the magic question, how can I support you, right? Um, so I love when I hear that question um, because my needs might be different from Sarah's needs. And it doesn't mean that I'm going to work less or more or any, any different, but having that opportunity to uh, express um, the things I I need in and at least hearing from my uh, managers and leaders uh, that they are willing to listen. I think that for me that um, that that's when magic happens. 